Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to set up a karate framework into our local. See now I am going to using for IntelliJ or to set up for our karate framework. And here I already set up here but we can able to do it another new project and we can able to do it here. But before that, yeah, once you open the IntelliJ, there you have to choose for new project, new project, and we can able to now it will show you project name. We can able to specify test variety. Now here you have to choose Java, then you need to choose for Cradle, then one point test JDK and then create. Okay, because we already done for Karate framework and all setup, right? Now here I'm doing for sorry, not Karate framework. We done for setup for Gradle project. In my previous video, I set up for Gradle project. Now we are going to set up for this Karate framework. Okay. In the Karate framework section, if you want to do that, first we need to go for file and system settings. And here there is a plugin. Inside the plugin, we can able to search for Karate. Okay, in that karate we need to install. This is the karate framework and we need to paid version it will show and we can able to enable for that and we can able to use it. Apply. Okay. Okay, it will add for your location. Then once it is done and you can able to see there is a SRC folder and it will give some value once we created that project and it will be done it will provide for us okay now we done for plugin adding karate framework plugin we added and it will reinstall okay settings plugins and it is disabled mode present because my previous video it is added the plugin and we need to gradle already it will installed here and you can able to search already version it is already installed here okay that's why it is not showing for installed place normal location but it is a paid version but in this IntelliJ it is having for paid version but if you are going for Eclipse it is not like that it is normal okay and here again you can install there is no issues and you can able to uh, uh, demo version you will get the 30 days of free trial and that moment you can able to complete your testing things and you can able to do it and if you are using company laptop or something like that moment also you will get it for uh, paid versions also you can able to use it based upon your company requirement okay once you've done and you install like uh, uh, it will restart your system uh, not system that's intel j1 okay once you've done that one and second step is we need to create data we done already and a build config file you have to open where you need to use it these two files and you can go to here and copy paste this one and save it and it will by default it will download for all the things okay mine is up and running everything is perfect no issues 
and we need to create file and there is validation we need to do it and here we need to create one future file and that future file we need to specify and previous video I done for all the things properly and we'll go and see there how it is presented and also few more things we have to add it here that I forgot to add these four lines sometimes you will get some errors this is also I am going to keep it for here after this line just you have you need to copy paste these lines also because sometimes when you are running for your command uh, program right that moment you will get some errors okay to do that you have to use it that three lines and also there is another one is source set this particular code also you have to add it into your build.gradle file after dependencies after dependencies start and end press after that you have to enter enter two enters then you have to copy paste source set to running your code okay and then we need to this one we'll learn into a next video the source test and inside the java i created for testing purpose okay and here we need to create a sample how we can able to access and all this is a simple example one future file and this feature you can able to in case if you installed karate framework plugin here then you will see this is a karate symbol this symbol you can able to see into your local once you created the future file in here you need to go to new java class or file if you want to create future file you can able to click the folder place and you need to go to here and file and specify the name and extension for dot future once you've done that one it will add into your file into this folder okay once you added the folder this particular step then you can able to go to any one file class we need to create in the class if you want to run all future file which all the things are present in this particular folder you can able to specify that this options and here is at the rate karate dot test it is basically to running your future file purpose using karate and i'm using for j unit file karate j unit file that's why i'm using for other it test and karate test all return karate dot run dot relative class if it you running this one then it will execute for all the future files what all the things are presented if you want to specific one you want to run means you need to in this location you have to mention for karate run and which is the future name which future we want to run that future name we need to specify then it will execute now i'm going to specifying this future file which is presented this particular one right for this running purpose you can able to use it and here in the run place i'm just i'm going to verify like verify users it is no need to mention for dot feature file and it will go into this particular folder and then inside the folder it will go and see the value and it is whether the matched value is presented or not if it is presented it will go and then it will run just you need to right click run run action class then once you run this one it will execute
you can able to see after execution it will show some pass conditions if it is pass running everything is perfect and there is no issue then it will give us a green in case your feature file is not running properly it is failing something then it will show failed now my everything is passed and you can able to see the green color and pass percentage and you can able to maximize this one and see here it gives all the data related things and final inclusion pass and there is no fail and how much time it is taken up and running which particular and even you can able to execute for in the command place test iphone iphone test and which is the com dot demo dot run action this class also we can this command also we can able to use and run for that particular class into command line okay this command line running also we'll discuss in the later video sessions and this is the simple setup for karate framework and showing some demo class how it is executed okay that's all about this video i hope you enjoy this video if you like this video please like me please subscribe my youtube channel don't forget to share your friends and colleagues thank you